What's up, Facebook? This is Austin Wells uh, reporting from Blue Ribbon News Rockwall Live, your number one source for good news in Rockwall County. Uh, today I'm here um, outside the Rockwall Pregnancy Resource Center um, uh, to get a tour of their new, uh, newly renovated uh, facility. So let's go. Go in here for a quick. And here we have the the director, uh, Joanne. Let Hello, me turn Blue the camera Ribbon. real quick. Family. Hello, <laughs> Blue Ribbon family. All right, jo uh, Joanne, could you kind of give us just a little bit of overview of what the uh, sure. Pregnancy Center is and the services you offer? Yes, sir. The Pregnancy Resource Center has been here in Rockwall since 2000, offering hope and help to women facing unplanned pregnancies um, and just extending the love of Christ to everyone that walks through these doors. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. So how long have you, have you guys been in Rockwall? We've been in Rockwall since 2000, and we opened a satellite location in Mesquite in 2008. So for 10 years in Mesquite, almost 20 years here in Rockwall. But people don't often understand that we see clients not just in Rockwall and Mesquite, but the surrounding communities as well. So Roy City, Rowlett, Garland, Wiley, East Dallas, just all over the surrounding areas. Okay, so what, what, uh, what exactly uh, are the services that you guys uh, provide for your, for your clients? Sure, we do free pregnancy tests, free sonograms, counseling, material help, classes. Girls can come here and earn points by attending classes on any topic ranging from pregnancy, parenting, um, childbirth, and beyond. And they can come in as long as they need diapers and earn anything. They get points that they can then spend on car seats, diapers, cribs, and everything is brand new to the client. Um, so those are the services that we offer. We're the only place that offers all of those services for free. We do a lot of referrals also, so a lot mm -hmm. of times a girl will come in a pregnancy, we'll bring her here, maybe an unplanned pregnancy. But that's just a symptom of some other things that are going on. So we do a lot of referrals and work closely with other um, nonprofits in the area to refer and just help these girls to kind of see what's out there and how the community can support them. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. So uh, I heard you guys just recently uh, renovated your, your office here, and I was yes. wondering if I could get a tour of that. I would love to give you a tour. It's awesome. one of my favorite things to do. All this right. house we purchased um, because of the generosity of our donors. We were able to set money aside for years and um, be able to purchase this home two years ago, and it's right on Ridge Road. If you've driven by, you've seen it, and we'd like to welcome all of y'all to stop by because that's kind of the best way to see this place in person and see what's going on here. Um, our office in Mesquite, real quickly, is at Town East and Galloway. Mm -hmm. So if you're ever in that area, pop in there as well. But this is a front room, so this was a two-bedroom home, um, and this room at, was a dining room. So this is where the girls come in, and we've worked hard to make it very welcoming and warm. And girls love it here. Um, our exit surveys, we get comments all the time, like how this place is warm and welcoming and not scary. Somebody put recently, not scary at all, like a doctor's office. So we're proud of that. So this is the front room. And it was a two-bedroom home, so this area is um, pretty much untouched. That was the original bathroom that we had to make um, handicap friendly accessible, but it's basically the original bathroom, the original hall, and it was a two-bedroom home, so this room was untouched. This is the clinic, and this is where we do that. We have the medical component of our services and then our faith component. So we share the gospel with every girl that walks through the doors, and that's our faith kind of component of, of just love in action. Mm -hmm. And then this is the medical component. So this is where the nurse will come in and do the uh, pregnancy test results, the sonogram. If a girl is open to it, we'll do the sonogram here and project the image on the big screen just to kind of give her um, more detail about the life that she's carrying inside. And it's just a beautiful thing to see. This I'm very proud of because I think it makes us very legit. This is our pass-through. So girls can place their specimen in there and then the nurse runs a test right here. Very this cool. was one bedroom that was untouched, and this whole area was another bedroom that we broken down to two counseling rooms, which are small by design. So this is where the girl will come in, our volunteer counselors. Most of our staff is volunteers, so if anyone's interested in coming in, loving on girls, um, this is a great place to serve. Mm -hmm. This is where we store our diapers. So you can see we've been blessed greatly by the community, and we appreciate that. Um, so this is where we store the diapers. Every other material item are purchased brand new. So as they come in, we give them out. But we have two small counseling rooms. And then through here, this is what once what, 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 what was the front room. And this is where our volunteers hang out. And that's all the literature we give out. This is our curriculum in here for the classes that the girls take. Um, and so you can see there's all kinds of topics. And then we have all kinds of handouts. 
that we give out as well. So that's, this is just kind of volunteer hangout. This room is what we're very proud of. This is the Lou and Judy Adams prayer room that was dedicated to two of our volunteers that have served in the ministry for 30 years in different areas. But Lou um, had the idea of enclosing our front porch and making it into a prayer room. So this is the Lou and Judy Adams prayer room. These are pews that were in their church growing up in Pleasant Grove. Um, he made us this kneeler, and it's just a beautiful place where we can lift up our girls, we can um, open in prayer before every shift, our volunteers come in here and pray over our schedule, um, and just any needs that we have for the ministry. Um, and so this is kind of the, um, where the house ended and the garage was over here, which is now our administrative section that houses all of our admin. Gotcha. So, yeah. Very neat. And we very see, neat. you know, people like always ask how many girls we see a year. It's about 1,200 clients walk through these doors in Mesquite combined. Um, so that's kind of a little bit about the PRC. Thank you all so much for stopping by. Awesome. Thank yeah. you so much. Uh, yeah, let me turn this camera here. <laughs> all right. Well, uh, there you have it. There's a tour of the uh, Rockwall Pregnancy Resource Center. Um, thanks for tuning in, guys. I'll catch you next time. <laughs>